Advertising used to be simple. If a soap maker wanted to sell more soap, he hired someone to make a commercial and then paid a television station to air it. And the soap maker hoped the people who saw the commercial bought more soap. Then came the internet. It promised technology that would turn advertising into a data-driven science. The soap maker can now buy thousands of spots directly targeting the very people who are most likely to buy soap at exactly the moment when they need that soap. The internet could finally make advertising efficient. Oh man, I need some soap. And on the surface, this plan seems to be working. This year, an estimated $7.8 billion will be spent on web video ads in the US. For example, imagine a 15 second commercial for soap that plays before a funny cat video. Here's how that ad gets there. The soap maker's advertising order goes to a high-tech exchange where algorithms find websites that'll reach likely soap buyers. Say, a site with a video of a cat in a bathtub. The more views the video gets, presumably, the more people will buy soap. Except, that's not always the case. Many of the ads that the soap maker pays to play at the start of a video aren't seen by real people at all. You see, sometimes, the website that hosts the cat video will pay a company to boost the number of views they get. Those views can be legitimate, actual people watching the cat video and the soap ad before. But other times, the views can come from so-called bots. A bot is a computer that has been hijacked by malware to visit a particular site on its own, even when there's no human operating it. By one estimate, more than half of all purchased traffic is made up of bots. To the soap maker, that the bots might seem like real people watching his ad. Wonderful. But they're fake. Last year, a study found that 11% of display ads and nearly a quarter of the pricier video ads on the web were served to bots. And here's the kicker. Most websites pay for traffic in some way. Views, the currency of the internet, can be worth a lot of money. 50,000 views from a bot might cost only $50, but they can fetch advertising revenue of $500 or more. It is a slippery business indeed.